well, good evening, uh, viewers, and welcome to another episode of Hey Josh, What You Drinking? <clears throat> With me, Josh. Tonight, what am I drinking? I have, by request, well, not actually by request, but by uh, um, request. Yeah, request. Sure. Well, let's say whether we by request we have Old Flame Brewing Company Red Vienna Lager. Now, uh, a friend of mine, uh, she sent me a, uh, a, a somewhat, I wouldn't say a parody uh, uh, a video of. Hey Josh, what you drinking? Uh, where it was Hey Jen, what you drinking? But she sent me a uh, a very nice. Uh, well, are we gonna say parody? Or are we gonna say uh, compliment video? Complimentary. Anyway, her partner uh, gave her a can of his one of his favorites, which was Old Flame Red Vienna, and uh, she did the whole. Hey, Josh, what you drinking? But it was, hey, Jan, what you drinking? And uh, she did a very good job. I'm going to try to find a way to bring guests on my show. And perhaps Jen can be one of my guests. We can drink Red Vienna Lager together. Anywho, um, Old Flame. I have never, I've never heard of Old Flame until yesterday. I've never tried Old Flame until today uh i just so happened to have stopped by the uh lcbo in bell's corners to pick up some wine for my lovely spouse and uh as usual i peruse the uh the craft beer section and lo and behold this one that <clears throat> my friend jen told me about just the day before so i grabbed it it looks good i mean I've never, I don't know what to expect. That's the fun of this, isn't it? You don't know what to expect. Sometimes it's good, sometimes it's not so good. Um, Old Flame Brewing Company from Port Perry, Ontario. Uh, this is a, as I've mentioned a couple times, a Vienna Lager. So I'm expecting a... Uh, copper to reddish brown um, pour with a decent clarity um, I would expect a a fairly hoppy bitterness a, a medium uh, with a nice toasty malt character um, perhaps a a kind of a medium carbonation and a, a, a creamy body to it Hey, there's only one thing to do now is open this and see what we've got. Okay, first of all, it's got a nice hoppy aroma with a, a somewhat malty, or pardon me, roasty aroma to it. Yeah, this is uh, so far so good. Uh, hey, give it the pour, the old pour. And indeed, it's got a nice reddish, uh, reddish hue to it. It's uh, good and good and carbonated. Uh, rocky head, a nice uh, foamy rocky head to it. So far, so good. I'm uh, uh, duly impressed. Okay, it's a. Can you see that? It's got a a dark amber amber uh, color to it here right that's better oh hold on i gotta take a that's a lot of paper <laughs> my uh my daughter's taking the recycling out so. no, I'm taking it to the fireplace. oh you're taking it to the fireplace that's better that's burn shit okay uh picture for my my insta and untap again you can follow me on insta uh, the original joshua j uh same with untap the original the original Joshua J. Um, okay, it's got it's got the it's got a very mild alcoholic aroma to it. 
Mm. It's got a a moderate hoppy smell. Uh, I would. It's not. the The malt is much more noticeable than the than the hops for sure. It's got a, a degree of toastiness to it. Well, down the hatch, eh? Let's see what we got. Okay. Mm. That is enjoyable. It's got a very malt forward flavor to it. It was slightly sweet. It's, you know, sometimes a malt will give you other flavors too. But it's not. It's just malt. I like it. It's very good. Um, it's got again the the carb the, the head has dissipated. It's still quite uh, carbonated, very quite effervescent. It's got a very medium medium to mild mouth feel. It's not as creamy as I would have expected. It's quite sweet. The thing is, though, where I can smell the hops, I can't really taste them. It's very low in bitterness, where I would have expected more from the aroma, for sure. Mm. All right, well, for my first uh, foyer, foyer, fair, my f the first time I ever tried this one, Old Flame... Uh, Old Flame Brewing Company from uh, Port Perry, Ontario. I got two other selections uh, at the same time, so I'm looking forward to these. I'm quite impressed. Uh, now I can see why uh, uh, Jen's partner is so fond of this. I am also quite fond of this as well. Well, I'm going to finish this off, and uh, it's Friday night. Perhaps I'll have another. Maybe I'll make a video, maybe I won't. You know what? When I crack open a beer now and I don't make a video, I feel, oh, I should be making a video. But it's all right. Sometimes we can just enjoy our beer and not post everything we do, right? We don't have to document everything we do forever. All right, guys. And uh, happy Friday. Oh, shit. It's not Friday at all, it's Saturday. <laughs> I lost a day. Holy shit, what happened? Anyway, happy Saturday. I hope you're enjoying your weekend. If you're a football fan and you're going to watch the Super Bowl tomorrow, hut hut, hike hike, me, I'll probably just drink a beer. Cheers. <sighs> Good night.